guys, Joe from One Up Reviews, and today we've got a look at the Star Wars NMT R1 V2. Before we get into the review, guys, if you are new to our channel, remember to hit that subscribe button, hit that notifications bell, and you'll never miss any of our latest reviews. So let's get into it. And right off the bat, look at that box. As you can tell, this is uh, part of the Star Wars collaboration that Adidas have been doing for over 10 years, I think. Like, I'm not 100% sure about the, how many collaborations they've done in the past, but this is one of the more recent ones to celebrate the 40 years of, in my opinion, one of the greatest films ever made, and that is Star Wars Episode Five: The Empire Strikes Back. And what a way to um, commemorate this with our purchase of the smoothest man in the galaxy we've got lando calrissian and sneaker is is the nmd uh r1 it's the v2 version so it's the version 2 and what i want to start off by is like i mentioned this box is just so beautiful it's just showing back to the days of the old school toys that came out in the 70s of the normal like not the normal it was the og star wars toys they came out in a similar box as such, uh, with the action figure inside, it was so dope. And that was similar to the OG, the first releases of the Star Wars Adidas collection. They came in a nice toy box as well. And it was all laminated with the plastic. It was beautiful. This is such a nice touch as well. So you've got the nice cartoon of Lando here, AKA, well, Billy D. Williams. Uh, and you've got little hits of 40th anniversary, 40th anniversary there, and all right there, you've got the Star Wars logo, Free Stripe, and that side there as well, Free Stripe, Adidas logo, Star Wars logo, and oh, if you look at the back, so it's similar to like collect the other to toys, so you've got Boba, F Boba Fett there, Chewie, and Han Solo. And that would just make the collection. And as I mentioned, these characters, they have their own sneaker, similar to the Lando NMD that we have in our hands here. But before we get to the unboxing, let me just tell you what size and colorway we've got this in. So we've got this in a UK size eight. It's a European 42 and it's a US 8.5. And we've got this in the sky tint, core black, metallic gold colorway and Let's get open and right there. Here we go. Really dope. Like just the fact that it slides out, it's just giving you that premium feel. And oh, I do want to mention you get you get a little Lando poster there. Hold it. There and it looks like the figureheads that you would get with this, like the Stan Smith auto is the like I mentioned figureheads, the logos that they put in the tongue, which is a really cool touch. Put this box away. And we'll get looking at the sneakers. So it comes with these two lace locks there as well. Well, they can the decorative pieces you could put right there with the laces. But before that, we'll start with the outsole. So this outsole is typical NMD outsole with a rubber encasing the boost midsole. And it, I think it's really dope that Adidas have relaunched the NMD again. Uh, we've done like the OG NMD, we've done the original review of the V1s. The V2s are very different, as I'm gonna mention as we work our way up. But I think it got oversaturated, the NMD. There was a point a few years back when it was the most hyped sneaker in the market. That was when, in my opinion, Adidas were dominating the game with like the Ultra Boost, the NMD, all these like early Yeezys coming out. And as I mentioned, they oversaturated the market with all these NMD colorways, which is a shame because it really is a nice sneaker, great design, 
really is comfy and I'm sure this one is comfy as well but it, it did take a dent into Adidas's like stronghold on the market uh, that's my interpretation of it however it's dope to see that it's coming back and this is great use of the collab with Star Wars so it's really cool that they're using the smoothest man in the planet or the universe sorry in the galaxy with Lando just to make it more sleek and cool anyway so as we move along the upper so it's a nice mesh material it's the prime knit upper right here and you've got little bits of nylon from the tongue going towards the toe uh, there's a lot of fused materials so where the laces are just underneath here you've got the brand with the three stripes right there like Adidas's little motto that's a fused material and if you look in the medial side you've got probably one of Lando's greatest lines it's in regards to the Millennium Falcon which he was the owner of before Han and it was you know that ship saved my life quite a few times she's the fastest hunk of junk in the galaxy and that is true the Millennium Falcon was is one of the fastest ships in the galaxy and trying to hide the Star Wars nerd in me but uh, Han did the Kessel Run in under 8 parsecs so that was really fast and well I'm losing my train of thought because all I can think about is how great that film is if you haven't seen it go watch it yeah number five Empire Strikes Back is the greatest film in my opinion however you need to start with The Last Hope first forget the prequels and episode 7 was alright but that's for another day we'll continue with the review and it's got the typical NMD shape however where it's got that pull tab right there where it is like a hook that we'll find right there on the tab it's more melded here together with this back unit and you've got this typical NMD blocking that's there but as I mentioned the heel tab the pull tab thing is melted right here with this block at the back we'll talk about the front here so at the, just at the very bottom of the laces you've got the Star Wars logo and you can change it so you've got the Millennium Falcon and you've got Lando's name just to give you more options simple lace feature that is underneath leather panel right there and it's at the tongue you've got Lando's face uh, as the logo of the tongue and at the aglets you've got Lando Calrissian what can I say about the sneaker is really cool I think the the colors are a great interpretation of Lando's cape and the blue shirt that he wears in Empire I mean this is his, essentially his wardrobe in Empire Strikes Back and as I mentioned it's a great way to celebrate the 40th anniversary with doing it with like the smoothest character in the whole galaxy portrayed by Billy D. Williams, Lando Calrissian. I can't wait to try these on and I want to try it on with a cape. When it comes to the fit guys i do suggest you get probably a half size down with these v2s uh, other than there's a lot of more space right there at the toe it does fit well like my heel isn't coming off 
but I just feel like there's a lot of space in the front. So I do get a half size down because I usually wear a size eight for Adidas. So whatever your Adidas size is, go half a size down. This is great as we are big fans of Ultra Boost here at One Up Reviews. Yes, we know what to expect. Cushioning of the Boost, beautiful. Cannot um, rave on about it anymore. And it looks so cool on. Jeff at the back agrees. And it's really dope to see Star Wars as well. So I am just as smooth as Billy D. Williams with these on. Thanks guys for watching my room. To like, comment and subscribe, follow us at one up reviews with a Z at the end on Instagram. Until next time, peace.